Okay, folks, here's a quick review of the Captain Britain figure that was made by Hasbro as a part of the Captain America, the first Avenger line of products. I picked this up at uh, Target for $7.99. When I first got Captain Britain out of his blister pack, I was immediately attracted to the metallic sheen that was used uh, to paint this figure. However, uh, as you can see in the camera, the uh, paint applications were not evenly done. So in other words, right here you can see that the sheen is very nicely done on the head and the chest. However, on his shoulders, it's very dull looking. So I don't understand why uh, Hasbro did that. But uh, aside from that, um, the detailing on the figure looks very nice. Uh, his combat boots look really sharp and there don't seem to be any paint goofs on his pants or on the uh, blue areas around where his belt is. Anyway, uh, Captain Britain comes with the following two accessories, so let me pan down real quick and I'll show you what they are. Okay, and as you can see, uh, first up, Captain Britain comes with a rocket launcher. And just like with many other rocket launchers that have been featured in this line of products, the projectile fires right out. And the spring action is very nicely done. Also, uh, Captain Britain comes with Excalibur, uh, the sword. And the detailing on this is fairly nicely done. However, as you can see, uh, when I turn the sword over, there is uh, an error right here as you can see in the blade, and that's easily fixed uh, with just a little bit of paint. So here's one more look at the accessories that Captain Britain comes with. Okay, what I'm going to do now is do a 360 of the figure, and I'll let you all see uh, the detailing that was done on him all the way around. So overall, um, I don't mind this figure too much. Um, I think it looks pretty good. Um, I'm just disappointed with the uh, paint applications uh, around the shoulder area being dull instead of being uh, metallic, as is the case on uh, the character's mask and chest. So yeah, uh, I have no problem recommending this figure for your Captain America collection. All right, so on that note, take care and stay tuned for my next review. Have a good one.